we made these custom ramps years ago when it was in a different building and everything was inside but now we just have them segmented so that the door can close um, as far as getting on and on this you can see that over there by the storm drain it actually slopes back up so the angle of attack sucks but we use just foam race ramps and boards on the really ultra low stuff like for instance this corvette was pretty low but it gets on there just fine sometimes you got to take bumpers off it's not a big deal the next reason above ground is better is see that red strap it hooks to the inside of the drum housing and I can pull anything straight down so that this drum can absorb like 1,500, 1,600 foot pounds by itself. Obviously we have the belt. So true all wheel drive stuff. We've never made that much. GTR has only put about 450, 500 to the front. So, and then we built a deck. One thing we did different was we did extend this and add D rings because that extra two feet for tying stuff down really helps or long wheelbase trucks where you can do them in two-wheel drive they integrate pretty easily into the existing dyno like that was just drill and tap so that wasn't a big deal but adding d-rings further out then we use these style of straps because most control arms have a hole so you can grab these are great for actual tow hooks and then you'll get yourself a set of tow truck hooks like these we cut off the other two that we don't use most cars also have ovalized holes that you can put in that that hook in too so that you can grab if you can't get things snap chains tow truck hooks when wastegates are in the way. Bunch of little stuff, but common sense. This is the last thing. High torque front wheel drive or rear wheel drive belt dressing. This is the clear stuff. It's like VHT, but obviously cheaper and easier to find. So if you can't get enough tension by pulling down with straps, this is your go-to. This will help hook pretty much everything. Turns the, the tires into a hot mess, so we uh, do that to get like my car to hook and, and miles. Um, having good fans, so we got those up front. That, that works pretty good. Then one up in there, that's our extractor. So if you're building the building or gonna mod it anyway, you can set us up the same way and make a mini wind tunnel. The one you're talking about is gonna be way cooler than ours, but this definitely makes pretty, pretty big difference. If that content is something that you like, please consider giving me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so. Definitely leave comments for positive, negative. Let, let me know where I can improve, what you guys want to see in the future. It just helps the channel and it helps get you the content that you want. If Possibly you have a friend or community group that can benefit from content like this. Please consider sharing it with them. Facebook, Instagram, wherever you want to go. Lastly, if you want notified as new content is added, simply click on the bell icon and YouTube will do that for you. Thanks again, guys. Take care.